This video will contain spoilers. Love Lies Bleeding. Mixed ratings. I watched it in cinema. Kristen Stewart. Ed Harris, Dave Franco. There's someone at the door. Turns out there isn't someone at the door, it just sounded like there was. Anyway. Film 4 has been putting out some bangers recently. Like, you know, they did, did this, they did Eileen. Uh, shit, what else have they done recently? I mean, it wasn't recent, but, you know, they, they, they did Transpond in 1 and 2. So, I went into this thing and it was like an action thriller, like basically, well, it's why they compare it to something, but you know, just an action film. Uh, and it wasn't until like, maybe there was 20 minutes left that it was like, oh yeah, A24 would never make like, just an action film. Um... The best way I can describe this film is that it's uh, it's true romance, just if it were a drama instead of a a comedy or a dramedy, whatever you want to label true romance. I think that um, <laughs> that the bits were like um, what's her name. Jackie, yeah. Jackie takes the steroids or whatever it is, and you can like see the muscles grow on her immediately, and then at the end where she fucking but be becomes like giant. <laughs> I, I like it, but it's just it doesn't seem right for this film. It's very weird. Uh, whereas the rest of the film wasn't really. <laughs> you know, the, there's, you have questions, but I mean, they get answered. So there's nothing, there's nothing confusing or jarring about it. And then the, the fucking, they put that in. Um, it's... Despite the fact that I do really like it, it does seem like it's a, like a sort of anti-man movie. And fucking... I feel like Dave Franco has done a couple of those. Like, let me, let me look at his IMDb page. That's weird. Um, if we look at everything from... Going backwards from, like, now to... Let's say 2017. I have seen Love Lies Bleeding. The first episode of The After Party. Yeah, so, like, I don't know why I have this feeling that, like, he's done a couple other things where he played similar characters where the whole thing is just, fuck, man. Uh, there, there was a, a bit with Ed Harris's character that... I thought it was going to go in a different direction than it did. Like he, um, I thought he was going to like try and groom Jackie, and technically they just not in a sexual way. They try and make her his weapon. Uh, they do some gang. Sh I I don't think they really explain what he does. I think he it might just be gun smuggling. I'm not sure. Uh. So, yeah, it's, it seems like an anti-man movie, but it was quite entertaining, even if it does take a little bit to get started. 